I'll be on my ride wave any time of the day, baby. <laughs> hey, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Serena. Hence the intro. Hence the channel name. That's Serena. You get a corner, I know, but that's just how we are here. Period. So, this is the last episode of Vlogmas, y'all. I forgot to record when I was wrapping my gift, but here is how it looks. I'm not able to record when I'm inside my job, so I will check back in with y'all on lunchtime because me and Ebony always go out to eat for lunch. So, I know that I said that I would check back in after lunch. However, I mean, at lunch, like when Ebony was with me and we went, but it ended up being me, Jade, and Ebony. Then we ended up being in a rush because we were... Um, I don't even think I've ever had Jade and Ebony on my channel, actually. I'm just throwing out your, their names like y'all should know who they are. Um, stop looking at me. Um, yeah, we all went for lunch at Jason's Deli. Because <laughs> we need a salad. And I totally forgot. Well, I didn't forget. I was driving and I was like, oh shit, I'm supposed to be recording. But then we were suddenly in a rush because I was like, now it took us 20 minutes to get here and it's right down the road. Stop it. And we only have an hour lunch. So that is 20 minutes there, 20 minutes back. So 20 minutes left to eat. So we were like rushing, trying to eat. Okay, I love you too. Relax. Trying to eat our salads and they're like massive. So we weren't able to, but... Um, my secret Santa person was not at work. So I ended up giving my gift for her to Jade because somehow the names got mixed up and Jade didn't end up with a gift. So I gave mine to Jade and then Jade, stop it. And then Ebony was my secret Santa. I knew it. I freaking knew it. Cause I asked her, who do you got? And she wouldn't tell me, but Victoria told me straight away who she had. And I, I just knew, I knew she had me. I knew it. So anyways. Let's open up what she got. I put my headphones in here because otherwise I would have forgot to bring them home. Okay. It's the bag. The bag is too much. But I'm going to use the bag for somebody else's gift. So, don't be mad. Don't be mad. Boo. First things first, we got Poppy. It's all Body Works. So, we got Poppy by Bath & Body Works. And it smells like... It kind of smells like... um. Japanese cherry blossom. I know because that's my dad's favorite. This one is called butterfly. It looks like this. And this one gives more like a lilac coconut type of smell. And then this one is my favorite. Um, it is fall in bloom. It looks like this. Y'all already know it's on brand for me. It's orange. Come on. And this smells like I can't really describe it. Something that I have put in like a wallflower before. It says the fragrance notes is juicy plum, wild bloom, and velvet moss. It smells like a citrus. You wanna smell some butter? Can y'all see her little nose right here? <laughs> this smell good, right? This smell good. Yeah, mama, yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna keep this bag going cause let me, <laughs> I need it. Also, uh, this is another gift that is wrapped up. This is for Madison, uh, which is my sister, if you're new here. She asked me for an Apple Watch for Christmas. Am I made out of money? But anyways, that's what it was one of the many things on her expensive list. I don't know who these kids are this generation, but baby. Um, so I'm going to give this to her on Christmas. We go to Chateau Elan. Um, for Christmas Eve, my boyfriend and I for Christmas Eve until Christmas Day we check out. So we're gonna do all this stuff there, just me and him. Like I said, that's gonna be a separate uh, video. For now, I'm, the day I'm filming this is Wednesday, which is y'all day 11 vlogmas. So I just uploaded that. I am about to take the rest of my press-ons off because um, I have to take my braids out um, in my hair this wig is like just sitting on top of my head i just had to do something for work and i didn't feel like re-gluing down the other wig that i re-glued down for my shoot so yeah girl we are doing blonde highlights tomorrow i can't wait for y'all to see it i dropped the wig off on monday and my appointment is tomorrow at what time it's tomorrow right when she just told me i can come when i get off work so yeah, we're gonna say 5.30 because I get off at five. So I'll just zoom over there. Like I said, 
Y'all know, I live like 10 minutes away from my hairstylist, so it's a win. Why is this now really staying on? Like, yo, get off my finger now. Wow, it will not come off. Y'all see this? So yeah, y'all, I will check back in with y'all tomorrow at my hair appointment. Mm -hmm. Moving like next month? Mm -hmm. Get in and out quickly. Okay, It is the next day. I got my bang in a flexi rod because the curls were like doing all kinds of spirals. So disregard that. I was gonna do a Q and A. However, um, I think I wanna actually make that a separate video, like in a different setting other than like rush in the video. Like maybe like a chit chat, get ready with me while I am at Chateau Elan. I'll put it in that video. So make sure y'all stay tuned for that video and put your post notifications on because I'm, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I just made up my mind. So um, for now though, I need to pack for Chateau Elon and I need to pack Simba stuff because she is staying with her auntie while we are at Chateau tomorrow until Christmas day. I'm gonna pick her back up. So I'm gonna drop her off tonight so that when I wake up, we could just get a move on. Let me show, I gotta actually put her sweater on, so give me one second. Okay, right now she has this blue sweater on, but I'm about to change it to the red one because we're all wearing red and white for Christmas. Okay, thank you. She always tries to kiss me, y'all. Oh. <laughs> so we're gonna change her from this sweater to this one, the Paw Patrol with the Christmas hat on. So I'll be right back, cause y'all know she's gonna be forcing her arms into this sweater. She is such a baby, yo. We're on the Simba cam. Simba cam, this is her um, getting ready for Christmas, y'all. She wanted a little segment. Y'all, she's trying to put her head in it already. Like, can I put it on you? Look, girl, <laughs> lifting her arm. She said, hurry up, mommy. Other arm. She loves clothes, y'all. Get off the camera. <laughs> oh, it's super cute, mama. It's super cute. <laughs> you look so pretty. I love it. Say thanks, guys. You guys like my sweater? I love it. It's super cute, mama. Super cute. Thank you. I love it. I love it. You can get down. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's way later in the day. Um, child, I didn't try to go out and get last minute Christmas gifts for other people and No, we'll try again next year. I actually was almost having a borderline panic attack. Like I'm so overstimulated, overwhelmed. I like, I'm just over everything right now. Like too much, it's too much, you know? So <clears throat> trying to relax and I really needed this weekend with my man because baby, 
it's way too much going on okay i'm gonna put my phone on do not disturb and i'm gonna be sipping my wine with my man honey it, it and on top of that it is like astronomically cold <clears throat> i stopped that coffee i wish that they gave you more pita bread on the side for the free because i'm like i don't want to pay for the pita shit i'm so i am like i pick and choose what i want to be um frugal with my money <laughs> like girl and i only went to cobble because one of uh, my boyfriend's gifts is a hand and stone massage gift card because he's always complaining about how his back is tight and stuff not only does he need a chiropractor yes but i also got him a massage from Pain and stone. So it's in here. Give it to him when he gets off work. Oh yeah, we're just gonna have a nice chill weekend. I already know my gifts are because when he, he walked in with them last week and I was sitting right here. Literally I was sitting at the table and he walked in right here and he was like, I'm like, you suck at this, like you suck at this. If it's not wrapped up, I clearly see what it is. And mom was like, uh, he upgraded my Pandora ring. Super cute. Super cute. But yeah. Um, I got this bowl. Like, what to make in my bowl. For kava. Like, I've been there twice. This is going to be my third time. And I always like freestyle when I go in there. Because I really don't know what half the things on the menu is. And I have like random allergies that come out of nowhere. So I kind of like play it safe. So I was scrolling on TikTok and I was looking for people that I follow and seeing what their coffee order is. And then I just went off of that. So the girl that I got the order from, I'll put it right here on the screen. So you guys can also, you know, get some of this. <laughs> superior i don't really have anything to say i was gonna sit here and talk to y'all about like like an overall summary of this year but i don't even feel like talking about it i don't feel like talking about it i don't feel like reminiscing this has been a really tough year for me and i just rather not talk about it <laughs> you know every year people are like oh this is gonna be my year this is gonna be my year but I really do feel like 2023 will be a way better year for me. Very um, self-defining, self-discovering. Because, like, this year was more so, like, settling, trying to figure out my groove, you know? And then even with my job, it, it felt like, okay, I'm just here because it's safe. It has benefits. It pays me. And now i think i'm in the mood for like okay what do i actually want to do like what is my purpose like what do i actually enjoy doing i would like to wake up and enjoy what i do every day i drag my feet and i go to work every day like <sighs> one of these days i'm gonna have to go here you know and i don't like that so i think i'm gonna change my field completely <laughs> so like that y'all gonna be like this girl literally i graduated from college with a teaching degree and I work in a call center in my whole life I have been like a soup a supervisor or a team lead in a call center and now um and now I just feel like I want to wake up and be like okay babe going to work with my little thermos and my lunchbox you know like even if it's not like full-time being an influencer you know I just I really do love doing this, but like the numbers don't lie. Like I'm not blind. Like I appreciate everybody who watches my content. Absolutely. Because it takes me a while to actually film this content, make it something, you know, and give y'all quality and buy the equipment and edit and all that stuff. And you know, it takes a lot on me to make that kind of credit and to not have the results that you want after that. It's kind of like gut-wrenching and so i'm trying to like maneuver through that right now that feeling um yeah i was gonna do like a 2020 
what is the year is it? 2022 recap like I did for 2021 last year for Vlogmas. If you haven't watched last year's Vlogmas, I'll link it up here because baby, it was cute. But y'all were here. I vlogged. Y'all get it. Y'all get it. So yeah, I'm going to talk more about this in my chit chat. Get ready with me that I'm filming. So stay tuned for that. All new content. I'm going to take a break. So I won't be back until January. <laughs> I'm not even like I'm gonna be back like the second week of January, y'all. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm taking a break from this and I'm taking a break from my actual job. I'm on PTO now until January third. So I'm gonna holler at y'all on the flip side. Thank you guys for all your love and support. I'm okay. And I hope you are too. Enjoy this holiday season with your loved ones and you know, actually be present in the moment. That's something I want to work on this year. But yeah, I'll catch y'all on the flip side. Bye.